Hello ladies and gentlemen, thanks for showing up and watching my video, seeing me shave. Thanks for tuning in and all that jazz. So today um, I will be using, um, this is a soap, this is a second chance, this is a, a second chance uh, production of, uh, of this soap. This is Little Tim's Executive uh, I won this from a, uh, on a giveaway from uh, Carl Kiefer, thanks Carl, and uh, I used it one time, the last time I used it, it irritated me a little bit, and uh, so I will uh, give it a second chance and see what it does today. Uh, I got it in a got some scraped off in case I have to get rid of it I've scraped some off and uh, it's in my Maria Armon North America's best wet shavers group bowl hey lovely midnight blue and uh, today I will be shaving my face with the Pearson's wedge um, it's got acrylic green scales with a uh, with a uh, a white wedge this is a wedge razor it's one of those small wedge razors just with the square point and uh, this is a uh, it has a uh, sort of a hammered texture on the tang there if you can see that and I don't know if it'll focus in there a little hammered there yeah, there you go hammered texture on the tang and it says Pearson's Wedge there. Pearson's Handmade Wedge. So that's what we got here. This is a good shaver. Sacramento Barber Supply Company, Sacramento, California is where this was. That's what's stamped in the tang anyway. So anyway, let's, uh, let's keep going. Let's take some of this bloom water here and apply it to my face. Try to see if the blue water would lather up. It will not. So. How's everybody doing today? Hope you all are having a, a wonderful hump day Wednesday. It's uh rainy and stormy here so I got most of the day off today which sucks but when you're in construction it's hard to hard to uh, hard to work in the rain or hard to get stuff done in the rain so anyway we'll add a little bit of water to the bowl here this does lather up rather nicely. This soap does. Tim, little Tim's shave soaps. Uh, I got water on the label. I was trying not to do that. It splashed. It's not a waterproof label, folks. It kind of has a, uh, a citrusy. It's very light, very faint uh, with the uh, scent strength very faint but it does have that does have some nice creamy lather there with peaks and uh probably need a bit more water too i hope that wasn't too much here oh no that woke it up right there There we go. That's right. Peaky, peaky, peaky. So, 
Maybe one more time. Here we go. We're using the uh, Omega 10077 red acrylic handle bore brush. Nice lather. Okay. And here we go with the uh, with the wedge. I might bleed right there. Yeah, I took the uh, head off of a bump <clears throat> right there the last time I shaved. And so it's likely to happen again. Yeah, right there. Let's see if I can get around it. Uh -uh. Okay, well, there we go.
driver's pass gone. <clears throat> so far, no, uh, no real irritation. I thought at first that I felt a little bit of, when I first put some on there, uh, I thought that I was going to have a little bit of uh, itchy, but it is not, so. This is good lather. Mm-hmm. I need a touch up on this blade. I thought I was thinking about that in the first pass. But this this against the grain stuff right here letting me know real quick. Mm hmm, you know what that scab. From the other day. That's a nick, that's a bump.
Hmm. We're not gonna do that today. There's a little bit of slickness on here, but uh, that's it's not. Uh, it's not all that great at the slickness. So there you have it. Um it's a good shape. It's not at all my best and it's not at all my worst, so just a pretty good shave. Pretty good shave. Um let's uh rinse off one more time and then we'll put the uh atom block on here and see what he says. Yeah, yeah, that's... Oh, damn! That razor needs tune-up. Definitely. Definitely. Yeah, I'm on fire right now. Yeah, we're gonna have to... Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Dry off my iron block there. Rinse my face off with cold water. Lemon goes well with this. It is a citrusy scented soap, sort of. So we'll do that. And uh, today's aftershave will be um, Barbasol Pacific Rush. And I'll say that this flavor of a Barbasol here is a perfect match for that soap, in my opinion. Except that the Barbasol has just a little bit of menthol in it. Which actually I did not remember. I did not remember that it had menthol in it. I like it. I've used it before, but anyway. So uh thanks everybody for watching. Uh I hope you have a wonderful rest of your week. Um Take care of, uh, of those around you. Give your dog a hug. And uh, Baba Booey to you all. We'll talk to you later.